Look at example 10 uh, right now, a curve has a gradient function x squared plus ax plus b. So dy dx is x squared plus ax plus b, and its stationary points is 1, negative 1 over 6, and negative 2, k. Remember, for stationary point, dy dx equal to 0. So you try to substitute these two into the dy dx. Okay, the first one, you have x equal to 1, dy dx equal to 0. So you have dy dx is 0, x equal to 1, 1 squared is 1, then plus a plus b. So you have a plus b equal to negative 1. This is the first equation. The second equation, x equal to negative 2, dy dx equal to 0, because both are stationary points. So you have dy dx equal to 0, x equal to negative 2, negative 2 squared, you have 4 minus 2a plus b. So you have 2a plus, sorry, 2a minus b equal to 4. So this is the second equation. By solving these two equations, you have a equal to 1, b equal to negative 2. So you already have the value for a and b. Therefore, you can put your dy dx as x squared plus x minus 2. To find the equation of curve, you need to do integration of your dy dx, x squared plus x minus 2. So you have y equal to x3 over 3 plus x squared over 2 minus 2x plus c. Now you substitute one point, of course, you have to substitute this point here, 1 negative 1 over 6. That is negative 1 over 6 equal to 1 over 3 plus 1 over 2 minus 2 plus c. So you will get the value for c equal to 1. Therefore, the equation of curve y equal to x cubed over 3 plus x squared over 2 minus 2x plus 1. So part C, the value of k. So this point here, negative 2k. Now you need to find the value of k. Very simple, because you already have the equation. You just substitute y as k, x as negative 2 into the equation. So just press your calculator, you get the value for k, which is 13 over 3. So the last one, you have to find the equation of the normal at the point 1 negative 1 over 6. Okay, this will be a little bit tricky here because you see that this actually is your stationary point, meaning it's your maximum or minimum point. Okay. So this is something like this. And the dy dx equal to 0. Let's see. We erase this part here. So meaning this is a stationary point, meaning it can be, let's say, let's say this is a minimum point. This is 1, negative 1 over 6. Okay, for this, your equation of tangent is something like this, which is a horizontal line, eh, because this is actually a minimum point or maximum point. This is your equation for tangent, which is the horizontal line. Your equation for normal is a vertical line. So this is your tangent. What is your equation for tangent? y equal to negative 1 over 6 is a horizontal line. This is the equation of normal. This is a vertical line. That is, the equation for normal is x equal to 1. So this is the answer for equation of normal. Okay, please have a look on this and try to understand this.